Tomorrow is International Credit Union Day, and we're kicking off the celebrations by learning more about these financial institutions. Schools First Federal Credit Union is here to share a little more about what credit unions are and why they're worth celebrating. Here to explain is Travis Mara, the Roseville Branch Manager for Schools First Federal Credit Union. Hey, Travis. Hey, good morning. Good morning. So a big celebration coming tomorrow. What yeah. is International Credit Union Day all about? Yeah, you know, like you said, uh, International Credit Union Day is tomorrow, October 19th. And it's really just a day to kind of recognize and celebrate the credit union movement, as well as the value that credit unions bring, not just to the members, but to the communities it serves. Yeah. Uh, it occurs on the third Thursday in October. Mm -hmm. And actually this year is the 75th anniversary. So big, uh, big deal. And uh, having personally worked in credit unions for yeah. 16 years, you know, this is an event that I hold near and dear to my heart. Yeah, that's why we're matching. We're, yeah. we're rocking the exactly. colors for schools first memo. today. <laughs> <laughs> and for those who don't know, can you give us an overview of what exactly a credit union is? Yeah, it's a great question to get it asked a lot. You know, a credit union is a not-for-profit financial organization that really exists just to serve its members. Yeah. And much like banks, you know, credit unions accept deposits, make loans, and have a variety of financial services. Uh, a great thing about credit unions is any of the profits are returned back to the members in the form of better rates on their loan products, mm -hmm. as well as lower fees and a low to no cost services. All right, and there's a lot of similarities between a bank and a mm -hmm. credit union, but also some key differences. Can you talk about what those are? Yeah, definitely. Uh, there are uh, several differences uh, between credit unions and banks. Uh, kind of the first difference I would say is credit unions somewhat uh, limit who can join. Mm -hmm. uh, each credit union is going to vary differently on where their membership comes from. Uh, some it may be based on like a specific employer group, others it may just be where they are like a geographic location. Mm -hmm. uh, another difference is credit unions are cooperative even amongst other credit unions. Yeah. Uh, many credit unions like to leverage that kind of pooled resources mentality yeah. and what they do is they utilize each other's resources to tap into kind of a shared branch and ATM network. So what that means is members of certain credit unions can access surcharge free ATMs nationwide as well as use uh, shared branches. So it feels like they're going into their own branch of their own uh, kind of a credit union, yeah. even though it's out of the area. And then finally, my favorite uh, difference is credit union decisions are made by a member appointed board. Mm -hmm. And those decisions are based on what's best for the members, not shareholders. Yeah. And so you really have that uh, member ownership type of feeling and every member does get a vote and they can use that vote to determine who sits on that board. So your voice really does matter in credit unions. Yeah, one of the things I hear from people who have credit unions that they like is on Thursdays they get the paycheck for the direct deposit yeah. opposed to Friday. So that's Day early, yes. <laughs> yes. There you go, so that's yeah. a plus. <laughs> And since credit unions are owned by members, tell us more about the safety behind credit unions. Yeah, safety, especially in this uh, environment, is very uh, key. A lot of members are uh, concerned about that. So yeah. all uh, federally insured you know, credit union deposit accounts are insured by the NCOA, mm -hmm. and that stands for the National Credit Union Administration. Uh, the NCOA you know, provides coverage to insure members deposits are covered uh, through all federally insured credit unions yeah. and that coverage is generally uh, about 250,000 per member. Wow. Okay. And we're all in. So how can we celebrate this big day? This yeah, occasion? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Glad you asked. So, you know, it is a, a great day to uh, just kind of take a look at yourself and see am I eligible to join a credit union mm -hmm. and learn about how that eligibility can really benefit me in a personal, uh, you know, financial situation. We all are always looking at how can I better my financial picture and it's a great way. So for example, schools uh, first federal credit union serves uh, school employees and their immediate family. So yeah. if you or your immediate family uh, works for a school or a school district in California, mm -hmm. whether it's an educator or a classified employee, you're eligible for our membership. And since we have kind of a specific membership, yeah. our products and services are tailored and geared for that membership. For example, uh, we have loans that are for classroom supplies, uniforms, computers, or even oh. higher education, uh, as well as other specific needs for our membership base. We have uh, deposit products such as a summer saver or a paycheck planner that is designed and geared to help our school employees save for those summer months. So, yeah. you know, it's just an example of how credit unions are designed to 
benefit their membership uh, exclusively and specifically. Yeah. So, uh, you know, any other information you're looking for on the difference between uh, credit unions and banks, please visit our website at schoolsfirstfcu.org. All righty, we're looking at some of those pictures of people who have been members for quite some years, so that's amazing. Yeah, yeah it's, uh, <laughs> and it's a gift of membership. You yeah. can pass it down to your uh, family, and so it, it yeah. truly is kind of a uh, a hometown feel and people helping people, which is how credit unions all started. There we go. Well, yeah. I know I'm saying it early, but happy International Credit Union Thank Day you. to you. <laughs> Likewise. All righty. And you can visit one of the many schools first federal credit union branch locations as seen on the screen. And like Travis mentioned, you can find one out more online by going to schoolsfirstfcu.org 